good uh, morning, <laughs> everyone. Okay, so today we will be discussing about graduated commission. So, in graduated commission, it means that there will be levels of sales. And when you um, go up one level, the rate of commission will also go up. No po. So, kumbaga, pag mas marami kang nabenta, okay, mas malaki yung maging rate of commission mo on a certain level. So, let's say we have ayan, ito muna pala sa steps muna tayo. So, for step 1, we identify the amount of sales per level. Okay? Step 2, calculate the commission on each level sales by multiplying the sales to its corresponding rate of commission. So, ganun pa rin naman yung pag, uh, paghahanap ng commission. We multiply the amount of sales by the indicated rate. Then, for step 3, add the products computed in step 2 to get the total commission. So, i-add na lang natin lahat ng commission per level. Okay? So, let us start with the first example. So, Mike works for a company that pays him 2% on the first 20,000 sold, 20,000 pesos sold, uh, 30,000 pesos, uh, 3%, and 5% sa all sales beyond 50,000 pesos. So, what is his gross pay if he sells 60,000 pesos? Okay, so this graduated commission will be easier if we put it in a table. So, ayun, meron tayong to table sa baba. Okay, so I will also put a table here. Medyo ano nga lang siya. Rough po na pag uh, sketch lang. Okay, I cannot write directly on the slide kasi. So, uh, ang ating first na level. Ayan, level 1. Level 2. Then level 3. Then, pagkatapos ng level 3 natin, we will just add to get the total commission. So, for level 1, our amount of sales, sabi nga dito, first, 20,000. So, ibig sabihin, 20,000 po ang first level. Okay? So, our rate, 2% on the first 20,000. So, this one is 0 0.02. Okay? So, for level 2, sabi, 3% on the next 30,000. So, all we have to do is put 30,000 here. Then, the rate will be 0 0.02. 03. Then, for level 3, on all sales beyond 50,000 pesos, eh, kaya lang ang sales niya ay 60,000. So, ilan, so, magkano po yung sumobra? Ayan. So, ang sumobra po is 10,000 pesos. So, lagay lang natin dun. Ayan. So, um, the rate will be 5%. So, it's 0 0.05. Okay. So, we will compute for the commission. Multiplying our given, we have um, 20,000 times 0 0.02, so it's 4, cancel dalawang 0, so it's 400. Okay, then so next one, we have 9, cancel dalawang 0, so it's 900. And the last one will be 5, Yan, then cancel ulit, it's 2 zeros. Okay, so to get the total commission, adding the numbers here, we will have 18, no, 1,800 1, pesos. Okay, so ito na po yung ating final answer. Total commission. Okay, so let us proceed with the next example. So, Anna has a monthly commission plan under which she receives 2% on the first 40,000 pesos. So, lagay ulit tayo, level 1, level 2, level 3. Then, add lang natin lahat ng magiging commission to get the total commission. So, sa level 1 natin, sorry, Ayusin natin dito, amount sold and the rate. Okay, so level 1, 40,000 pesos daw po. 
Then, 2% on the first 40,000. So, 0 0.02. Level 2 is um, 40,000 to 80,000. So, there's a bracket. So, para makuha mo yung uh, sales from 40 to 80, subtract the 2. Siyempre, higher minus lower tayo. So, that one is 40. Thousand pesos. Then the rate is three percent, so zero point zero three. Then the last one, uh, four percent in all sales over eighty thousand pesos. No po? So if we have here one hundred twenty six thousand minus eighty thousand, so this one is. Subtract natin. 126,000 minus 80,000. So, it's 46,000. Ayan. 0 0.04. Okay, so uh, we will multiply each. No, multiply lang. So, we will have here 8 and 800. Ayan, 800. Then, on the next one, we have 1,200. 1,200. Then, for the last one, we have 46 and 4. So, we have 32, 16, 17, 18. Wow. Okay, so 100. 84 dito, so it's 46,000 1,840 So, adding our total commission or our commissions so our total commission will be equal to ayan, so 0 this one is 4 then mm, 10, 8, yan. No, so, 3,840 pesos.